advanced estate planning usually isn't necessary until a family has at least $10 million. And based on the law today, it's about, it's over $20 million. But once you get into that $10 million range, you have enough complexity. And the more children you have, the more complex it is. The more marriages there were, the more complex it is. So the, the families that we work best with and can provide the most value are, are families that have a degree of complexity that also involves uh, a significant uh, amount of assets. For instance, one of the families that uh, we work with is in, up in that range. They're above that $20 million area. And they have, uh, they have four children, or they had four children. And one of them, who was being groomed to be the successor trustee, passed away uh, suddenly. And so the, the plan that we had in, in place was uh, had, had one configuration to it. But at that point, the family dynamics changed and the, the other three siblings had to get involved to see who among them had the desire and the capability to be the, the successor trustee as, as the family set this, this plan up. So families with a high uh, net worth and a, um, uh, children, and usually adult children, it's kind of tough to do it when children are below 15 uh, and even below 21 or 30 or 40. <laughs> but uh, uh, you, you can groom them along the way. So complexity, high net worth, and the desire to make the wealth last between generations is sort of a stereotype. We consider them stewardship families. And also another uh, characteristic that they have are most of the families we work with are entrepreneurs. So entrepreneurial stewardship families with high net worth and a significant degree of complexity are the families where we can help, uh, the families that we can help the most and have the most impact as they transfer their, uh, their family wealth.